convert your physical SIM to eSIM for Samsung device in 5 easy steps. Please note, it is mandatory to complete all 5 steps to activate eSIM on Samsung device. Please don't skip or avoid any step. To start the eSIM process, please ensure you have an eSIM compatible device and your email ID is registered for your Geo number. To check whether your device is compatible with Geo eSIM, go to www.geo.com. Click on eSIM activation. Select your device make and model. Now that you know your device is compatible with Geo eSIM, let's move to the next step. Let's check if your email ID is registered with Geo. Open My Geo app. Click on Burger menu. Tap on Profile and Settings. Tap on Profile. Check if your correct email ID is updated. If your email ID is not updated, tap on Change. Enter the email ID which you wish to register against your Geo number. An OTP will be sent on the requested email ID for validation. Enter the OTP and click Submit. Your email ID will be updated. To initiate the first step, you need to have the EID number and IMEI number of the device on which you wish to activate your Geo eSIM. Please write down the EID number and IMEI number as they are lengthy and need to be sent via SMS. Let's see how to find the EID and IMEI number on your Samsung device. Go to Settings. Tap on About Phone. You will find 15-digit number in IMEI eSIM field. Now tap on Status. You will find 32-digit EID number in EID field. Please write down IMEI eSIM number and EID number as you will need to type in SMS. Now that you have the EID and IMEI number, let's begin with the eSIM activation. Please note. You have to complete all the steps to activate the eSIM on your device. Do not skip any step. Step 1 Type Get eSIM space 32 digit EID space 15 digit IMEI and send to 199 from the Geo number you wish to upgrade to eSIM. If you get revert SMS, Asking to update your email ID. Please go ahead and update your email ID in your account as shown in the beginning of this video. On sending the correct EID and IMEI number to 199. In revert, you will receive 19 digit virtual eSIM number and activation code details via SMS on your Geo number. Please note, same details will also be sent on your registered email ID. If you get revert SMS or email asking to send correct EID and IMEI number, please verify EID and IMEI sent to you and resend SMS. Step 2. Copy the 19-digit eSIM number from the SMS sent on your Geo number. Open Messages and compose a new SMS. Type SIMCHG space paste or enter 19-digit eSIM number and send to 199. On sending the correct eSIM SMS, you will receive a confirmation SMS and email. If you get a SMS and email asking to send correct eSIM number, please verify eSIM number and resend the SMS to 199. Post sending 19 digit eSIM number, you will have to wait for 2 hours while we process your request. After 2 hours, you will receive a SMS and email from us requesting your consent to process your eSIM request. Step 3. Open Messages and compose a new SMS. Type 1 and send to 183. On sending the consent SMS, a confirmation SMS and email will be sent to you. Note, if you wish to cancel your eSIM request for any reason, type 2 and send to 183. Step 4. Within 10 minutes of sending consent SMS, you will receive an IVR call from plus 91 on your Geo number. 
asking you to confirm your new 19 digit eSIM number. Write and keep ready the 19 digit eSIM number that you would have received after completion of step 1 earlier as you would have to enter the same on the IVR. After successful entry of eSIM number on the IVR, a confirmation SMS and email will be sent to you. In case you have missed the IVR call or disconnected the same before you could enter the eSIM number. Don't worry, you will receive another call within 3 hours. If you get revert SMS and email asking to enter correct eSIM number on the IVR, please recheck the eSIM number from the SMS sent earlier and enter the same when you receive the next call. In case you don't get the first IVR call within 10 minutes of sending the consent SMS, we suggest you check your missed call list as you may not have answered the call thinking it is a spam call or check if you have enabled spam blocking via your phone's dialer or any third-party apps. As soon as you receive this SMS, your physical SIM will stop working and your phone will show no network. You are now just one step away from activating your new eSIM. Please ensure that your Samsung device is connected to the internet using Wi-Fi or mobile hotspot during this process. To complete the activation process, you need to configure eSIM profile using activation code on your Samsung device. Step 5. Go to Settings. Select Connections. Tap on SIM Card Manager. Tap on Add Mobile Plan. Select Scan Carrier QR Code. To enter activation code, tap on Enter Code instead. Enter activation code received via SMS and tap on Connect. Please wait while plan addition is in progress. It will take few seconds. After plan addition is completed, Geo eSIM gets successfully activated and reflected in SIM Card Manager. For any assistance with eSIM profile activation, please call us on 199 from any Geo number or call 1800-8899999 from non-Geo number. Please note, if you have both SIM card inserted into SIM 1 and SIM 2 slot, then SIM 2 will be turned off to enable eSIM. To turn on Geo eSIM, Tap on OK to enable eSIM on your Samsung device. Please note, as per regulatory guidelines, SMS services on your Geo number will not be available for 24 hours post eSIM upgrade. Important information Please don't click on Remove option as this will permanently delete your eSIM profile and you will not be able to use any Geo services. If you have unknowingly tapped on Remove, please visit your nearest Geo store with your proof of identity along with Samsung device and place a new request for eSIM. Unfortunately, it will not be possible to configure a new eSIM using the SMS process. Thank you.